Animal rights campaigners have taken three lambs from the King Sandringham estate in Norfolk. I've been an animal lover my whole life. When you see a lamb jumping around the field, you can't help but be filled with joy, regardless of if you connect with the reason why they're there. It's not the differences that matter, it's what's similar. You know, we can all experience fear, we can all experience pain, but also experience love and happiness and freedom, and that's what we want to give to these animals. If we don't save these sheep, essentially what will happen, the lambs will get taken to a slaughterhouse, whereas if we go and rescue them, they can actually live out their lives in peace and, you know, never experience the fear of a slaughterhouse. We just don't think it needs to be like this. No animal or anyone should be born into a life of exploitation. There's no need to be treating them like that and by breeding them and farming them we are destroying our native landscape. We are causing a biodiversity crisis that is speeding us towards climate catastrophe. We can't continue like this. There are barely any trees, everything's been deforested. Animal agriculture is the leading cause of the biodiversity crisis. It's one of the leading causes of the climate crisis. It is one of the most harmful industries that there is on this planet. But we can transition out of this. We can rewild the land that is freed up. Hopefully this action can have an impact not only on the three lambs that we rescued today, but also on the shape of our food system. We went with the intention of saving a family, but unfortunately that just wasn't possible, we realised. It did feel really heartbreaking having to make that decision, but I know that was the right decision. It's the only way that those lambs are going to live a life of freedom. I know that I'm not doing anything wrong. In fact, I'm doing the moral thing and the correct thing and the right thing. And we're willing to stand up in front of 12 ordinary people to take this question to trial and to ask whether saving animals from certain death is the wrong thing to do.